What's up guys, it's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Liquid Crystal walkthrough. Okay, so we're following up on that hollow uh, cave thing, and I looked it up, and trust me guys, I'm uh, just as a... Uh, I'm, I'm kind of feeling a little... Uh, I don't know, I don't know how to, how to feel about this one right here, but... Yes, in the last episode, we discovered the hollow cave. Didn't even realize that it was there. I got curious, and so I decided to go check it out, and right now we're going to be finishing this, this whole thing up. Um, I'm starting to think that this walkthrough right here is uh, going to be one of them exploration uh, walkthroughs. Kind of the ones that I would normally see just to get a clue of how to play other games. I don't know. Kind of like my other ones. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> so I, I, had to look, uh, I had to look up on two videos and stuff just to see how to get by here. And apparently there are seven uh, holes that you have to press on in order to get to this whole area right here. And luckily for me, I bought myself enough repels. And uh, let's see, I don't know if these uh, these uh, these holes actually regain their, or they, they turn back into holes. Okay, so we've already stomped on two, three, four, probably four holes right here. So I'm looking on the map right now, and uh, let's see, we got seven and four. There must be one right here somewhere. Yeah, that's, that's one right there. Okay, so there's one close right... Okay, so I didn't get these two right here. So that's, uh, let's see, you got three holes. And, uh, well, let's see. Yep, you gotta love those uh, super repels right there. So yeah, this is going to be like a exploration kind of a walkthrough. I just realized that. It's going to be an exploration, exploration walkthrough with you guys. And uh, you guys are going to be just as amazed as I am right here. Um, again, I've never played this game before. And, uh... Yeah, I'm just, a. am gonna be, the whole reaction part is gonna be all natural and all that stuff. Let me see, what is this one right here? Hold on. The hell? I've never seen this one before. That's probably one. Hold on. Probably is one. Okay, so that is one. So, where would this lead me? Let's see. Um, okay, so we're gonna try and go for the top portion right here because I think those are the last two that are left. But I don't think this would actually. Okay, so that right there will not lead me anywhere. Okay, let's go right here. And uh, okay, so we need to get to these two portions. And uh, again, repels. You gotta buy a lot of repels for this one right here, guys. It's gonna be a mission and a half. Let's see. Um, okay, so I'm sure that we have to go up here somewhere. Let's see. Maybe right here. Crap. Okay, so, uh, let's see, let's see. I'm gonna keep on going up. More up. More upper than up. And, uh, let's see. This area, I don't know where I'm at, so I'm only gonna assume that we're gonna be going right here. Okay, so let's see. Come on, where are the frickin'... Okay, it's not right here. I know that part. Okay, so there's seven holes. Remember, guys. Seven freaking holes. Let's see. Assuming that... Stop. Okay, I got it. Let's see. Let's see. Nope. All right, there. I'm assuming that we're gonna have to go right here. Nope. Okay, so that is the wrong area to go to. So I'm, I'm only assuming that it might have to be right here somewhere. Okay, and uh, this will actually lead me back to... Shit. Okay. Oh, God. This whole area is driving me up the wall. Okay, so here we're back. Hollow Cave. Go back down here. And, uh, okay, so now we're back down here. So now what we gotta do is, I'm only assuming, because I keep on assuming, let's see, right here, where the hell are you, freaking ladders, god dang it, okay, so we're back at square one, so we have to go back up here somewhere, right here, and so that will actually lead us to, we gotta go down here somewhere, I don't know. I've already been here before. So that part will lead us to the outside. So I'm assuming that it will have to be right up here somewhere. I don't know. Anywhere. God dang it. Come on. Where the hell are you? Okay, so right here. And uh, let's see. Okay, so repel wears off. I'm pretty sure we're going to be using all of these repels. It's 
It's freaking annoying. And, uh, let's see. So, okay, so this is, uh, the relic that is telling us to break all, this, all the holes. And yet, I can't find the other two ones. God dang it. Alright, let's see. Probably right here. Okay. God, I hate bumping into these goddamn pillars or rocks. Not right here. And, uh, gonna go right here. Maybe. I don't know. Nope. Maybe. Ah, oh, crud. It's the same goddamn place! Ugh! <laughs> Come on, speed button! <coughs> God dang. Okay, so. Damn, I'm feeling a little obsessed with this thing. Okay, so that's the wrong place to go. Good God. Okay, so go back up here. And if we go down here, maybe. I don't know. No, it sends us, sends us up right there. Okay, so right here. And, uh. Okay, so I kind of feel like we're far away from this god dang place. And, yeah, it doesn't take us anywhere. So, right back up here. And, uh, oh, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, um, where the hell are you? Maybe right here. Oh, god dang it! Are we in the same place again? Ah, oh, jeez, okay. Let's see, um, right here. And, uh, huh. Ah, Jesus. Okay, so we're back to the same place that we were at. So I'm assuming that's not the not not the place to go. So what if we go right here and uh, go right here into these stairs? I'm probably frustrating a lot of you guys because I don't know where I'm at. Ah, oh, God. Okay. Okay, so that's not the place. This is gonna be a while, guys. So please bear with me. So let's uh, let's see. Right here. We haven't been to this one, right? Have we? Ah, oh, crud. I, I kind of feel like we're in the same goddamn place. Alright, so we're using another repel. And, uh, instead of going up there, let's go up here. Oh, here we go! Finally! Okay, so I think I know where I'm headed now. Let's see. Um, right. No, wrong one. God dang. Okay, so. Let's see. Uh. Right here somewhere. See, this these these kinds of places get me all confused and stuff. So that's I think we did six, five or six. So here we are, and if we just move this way up here, and that might be number seven. Okay, so we broke number set six or seven. I don't even know. And. Uh, Repels worn off, and uh, okay, so there's nothing. Those are stairs. Those are stairs. Okay, so after that's done, seven, seven freaking holes. We go in here, and here we find an item, and believe it or not, it's a yellow flute. Now I was kind of thinking that it was going to be like a legendary Pokemon, but it's a freaking yellow flute. You know what this does? It cures confusion. A yellow flute, guys. Oh, God. Okay, well, that's what happens when you're too curious for this whole god dang thing. So, that's what it was all about, guys. Looking for a yellow flute, and, uh, well, time to get the heck out of here, and hopefully we don't discover other things out here. Okay, so here we are on Route 40, already defeat you. Defeated you! Hurt you badly. Nice twist. Nice add to it. Let's continue our adventure to, uh, well, uh, Cyanwood City? What does this guy has? Okay. Contains something. Yeah, I wonder what. It's a freaking yellow flute, bro. Yellow flute. Okay, so here we are, Fisher Johnson wanting to battle us. Coming out with the Rem Raid. I'm gonna use the speed button because I'm a little angry about this. All that, like, all those repels for a freaking yellow flute. Again, do you know what a yellow flute does? It freaking fixes up confusion. That's it. Okay, so, great battling you. Must go back to fishing. And, uh, well, I was kind of thinking that there was, there was going to be something else. Okay, so that was that, and, uh, I don't know where I'm at. We're at Route 41. 
And, uh, well, there's more Pokemon trainers right here that I haven't battled. So, let's see. Route 41. And I'm going to be skipping all those trainers. Skipping this guy right here. Look at that. We can find ourselves a Remoraid. And, uh, let's see. Nope, not use the escape rope because I may... It may move me or something. I don't even know. Okay, so let's go with this. And, uh... Okay, so let's see. Um, okay, so we are close to the World Islands, I believe. Yeah, close to the World Islands right here. And uh, where in the hell do you... Okay, so where are the Whirlpools? Oh, there they are. So that's a Whirlpool right there. And uh, we're just going to be moving straight forward to Sinewood City. Look at that, we're here. That's a lot of stuff. Okay, and uh, I believe you can go... Oh, wow, you can dive underwater. I didn't even know that. Okay, so... Let's see. Oh, shit. And would you look at that, it's Suicune. Look at that. Just like in the regular games, it's gonna disappear. It doesn't really make any noise. And just like always, you seen right here, he's like, Yo, Draven, wasn't that Suicune just now? I only caught a quick glimpse, but I thought I saw Suicune running on the waves. Suicune is beautiful and grand. And it races through towns and roads and simply awesome speeds. It's wonderful. I want to see you Suicune up close. I've decided I'll battle you as a trainer to earn Suicune, Suicune's re respect. Come on, Draven. Let's battle now. Okay. Okay, so here we go. Our next battle against Mystical Man Yusin. And, uh... Well, he is a—he is an interesting one because he loves his uh, psychic type Pokemon right here. Even though he's a mystical man, I don't even know if he's a mystical man. Alrighty, and uh, well, here comes that poison gas right there, and uh, crud, I'm getting poisoned just like that. So I—that's I, I, the equivalent of a fart. You're getting farted on, guys. So here we go, Surf Attack. Usain is using his freaking Hyper Potion because you know what? Why not? Let's use Hyper Potion. Or yeah. So there it is, kicking this drowsy's butt, and of course, I'm getting poisoned more and more. So let's go Ice Punch right here. Look at that. Oh yes, I love the sound of that. Suck it, drowsy. Yeah, buddy. And, uh, well, he's going to be coming out with an Electrode, so let's go straight to Stampy right here. I haven't seen this guy in quite some time. And, uh, alright, Stampy. I don't like you, you don't like me. But I think we've come to an understanding that if you use Rollout, you'll be better. You'll be a great Pokemon. Because you kind of look like a wheel or something. So there we go. Rollout attack. Get that. Okay, so that wasn't a, a strong. But here's a self-destruct. Okay. Self-destruct on me. That's all fine and dandy. Okay. And, uh, well, he's going to be using a Haunter. So let's go straight to, let's see, Toxic Batman. Did I delete... Did I delete the, uh... Crud, I'm, I'm trying to think. Did I delete Bite from this guy? Oh, I don't know. No, I didn't. So here we go. Bite attack. Talks to Batman for the win. Eat it, Haunter. Yeah, buddy. Alrighty. Okay. Alrighty. So that was a, a good victory for us. Yeah, I'm still a little frustrated about what I just uh, encountered. And uh, he gets it now. Searching for Suicune. But I'm sure we'll see each other again. See you around. Okay, well, whatever. It is what it is, so, of course, my Pokemon's gonna be poisoned. So, let's go ahead and use an antidote. My last hit antidote for this guy. And, uh, well, let's see. What does this house have to do? Or, what does this house do? Let's talk to this person. I, I see all, I know all. Certainly, I know, I know your, your Pokemon. Okay, Erwin. This Pokemon is at its final stage of evolution. Am I good or what? Incidentally, this Pokemon has grown and it's gained much strength. That is true. That is so goddamn true. Okay, so uh, that's nothing to see. The Pokeshear ahead. And, uh, well, here we are in Sinewood City. This is the photo studio. Don't know what... Wait, do they still take photos right here? Let's see, talk to this girl, you're looking to make a photo master, we decided to build a machine that let everybody use it and placed it in the Goldenrod game corner. Oh, my sister really enjoys collecting stickers and showing them off to people. You might meet her if you visit the Kanto region. Who knows? She might give you some stickers too. 
She lives in Cerulean City. Hmm, that kind of just, uh, it, 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 it sounds familiar. Where did we meet a person like that? Not in Cerulean City, but probably like in an island somewhere. And boulders are the, okay, hiding, rock smash, okay, so that, that is that right there. And, uh, well, let's see. If you use fly, yes, you can get back to Cyan or Olivine City. Okay, so first thing is first, uh, let's go right here. I think we're still gonna get ourselves a, uh, whatchamacallit, that, that bug type Pokemon with the super high def defense and stuff. So, well, let's go ahead and put uh, Stampy in for just a little bit. And uh, let's get back out there. Hold on. Draven, you won. I could tell by looking at you. Uh, won what? I don't know. Okay. So let's go right here and uh, explore just a little bit more of Olivine City. This guy, he's like, I'm in shock. A guy about your age with piercing eyes and long hair came in. He scared me into giving him my prize Pokemon. I still have one left, but what if uh, he comes back? You look strong. Could you look after my Pokemon for a while? Yes, I can. And here we have a Pokemon. I don't know what Pokemon it is. It might be something better. No, it's a Shuckle. So here's Shuckle. And it is both a Bug and Rock type Pokemon. And uh, its strongest points right here is its defense. Literally, its defense. Not much of an attacker. Not much of anything. Uh, a pure waste of Pokemon. That's pretty much what it is. <laughs> okay, so that's done. And uh, what if we go right here? Any new surprises? Let's see, your Pokemon appear to be fine. Is there something worrying you? Oh yes, the Lighthouse guy. Yeah, he's gonna give me a Secret Potion. And, uh, well, Secret Potion, of course, will actually help. Wait, 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 wait. Let's see, what do you sell? Oh, he sells, uh, okay, okay. So he does sell some stuff to me that I can actually use, so that's, that's, that's good right there. And it's raining. So, uh, okay. So in the next episode, guys, we're going to be facing the Sangwood City Gym Leader. Chuck, I think that's what his name is. And, uh, yeah, we won't be as confused as we sound like right now. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.